We're still together. We have two kids, Iago, who's 14, and Luca, who's 11. You know, we went through a lot of tissues during our first interview. <laughs> I don't say a lot, but I cry a lot. Also, how much we spoke to, like, our future children. How presumptuous was that? I don't think before it's saying those words, had I even thought about the idea of having children. I was 24 years old. And we were young and in love. Yes, I definitely was that. But I was not young and in love with children. <laughs> Do you remember what we did right after we came out of the interview? We got on the train. I think we went to a bed and breakfast just outside the city. Yeah, you knew that I liked history. So you found this little historic b and you, you had told me how you are part of a history club, and I only learned later it was a Lord of the Rings fan club. I didn't want you to think that I was a geek or something. And this is a lesson. Sometimes you don't know everything about your partner when you get engaged, especially if it's after three months. <laughs> what do you hope our kids or our grandkids take away from listening to these recordings? So I hope they will learn who we were back then as a young couple in love with all these hopes and dreams and no responsibilities. Um, you're a much better singer than me, so please help me out as much as you can. But love me tender, love me sweet, never let me go. And then in this interview, they'll meet us as an established couple who went through all the growing pains of getting to know each other and had problems in life, but we're very fortunate to be able to overcome them. Oh, my darling Deborah, I love you. And I always will. <laughs>